Debbie Freeman has been part of the Blue Water Health team for 36 years and throughout that time has enabled countless people to reach a level of outstanding performance. As the Executive Assistant for Rural Health, Debbie is dedicated to making CEH a better hospital environment by engaging clinical teams and community partners, understanding their goals and helping them to reach these goals together. Debbie helps CEH reach its potential by coordinating the collaborative approach of community and hospital integration. She serves as a resource to community programs such as the Rural Health Advisory Panel, Rural Health Council, Rural Health Physicians Group, Foundation, and Auxiliary by supporting their activities. Debbie promotes a culture of kindness at CEH through acts big and small. Debbie worked on the Wall of Thanks, which is a visual celebration of the ways in which the community supports our hospital to thank them for their generous contributions and continued support. Debbie makes decisions with respect, integrity, compassion, and care for the staff, physicians, volunteers, and community partners. When making decisions about resources and process improvements in the hospital, she always says, well, let's think about what Emily would want. As the Manager of Nutrition and Food Services and Diabetes and Clinical Nutrition, Shailen Kemmerlein uses finite resources and innovative approaches to positively contribute to patients' health outcomes and experience. Better nutrition contributes to shorter stays and fewer readmissions, lowering costs and indirectly easing bed pressures and emergency department wait times. Shay Lin and her team have revamped patient menu and patient food and beverage preference forms, decreasing their cost from $35 per patient meal day to $32, while improving on patient nutrition, meal quality, portion size, and patient satisfaction. Shay Lin builds and grows partnerships, collaborating with stakeholders in healthcare and nutrition to advance care. She worked with the Central Lambton Family Health Team to coordinate diabetes care for patients in Petrolia and rural Lambton County, avoiding duplication of services, and to have patients seen by the diabetes education team most closely affiliated with their primary care provider. Shaylin brings her department to the forefront by improving employee engagement and morale. She has a gentle approach and a transformational leadership style that exhibits her philosophy of stewardship. She focuses on team and professional development and gets everyone involved in change. She promotes her best knowledge and supports staff so they feel confident in their work. As a professional practice supervisor, Lori Robichaud works tirelessly behind the scenes, making sure that resources are available to support staff with the skills they require to perform their jobs. Lori's commitment to quality care is evident. She works collaboratively with frontline staff to ensure resources are user-friendly and supports initiatives to promote best practice within the organization. Lori has developed relationships with Trillium Gift of Life Network and the Neurological Education Outreach Network to provide education to staff and support their initiatives. Lori is attentive to lean methodology and is fiscally responsible, offering methods to conserve without compromising patient care or safety. Lori models behaviors that embody a culture of kindness. She makes a point to acknowledge the work of others and thank them for their contributions to new initiatives or changes in practice. She is innovative in how we provide access of families to patients, for example, suggesting an opportunity to use OTN for families who are unable to visit from other cities. She always brings the patient and family to the forefront of care by discussing how changes to practice impact and improve care and the patient experience. 